M0 FXB. Let's get our call sign into our Yesu FTX1. So all you do is hold down the function, go to display settings, tap, and at the moment at the top here, which says display, yeah, if you tap it, it just says FTX1. So all you do is go forward, like so, and then delete. And we'll go M and zero back to that F X B and then we're going to put a, a slash there and we're going to go see if it will fit in not, not sure F T I think it will yeah X and then one there you go Let's make sure that was a one F T X one, yeah, it just looks small. Enter, and that's back. Now let's see if it appears when we reboot. So we're just going to go and then on. It does. Now let's try just quickly try the APRS one as well. APRS, go to. APRS select done and let's I know it's off at the moment but let's just see if our uh, call sign M uh, zero F X B does it let me do the dash thing uh, let's try it and see what it does dash no it doesn't so enter and go back Let's turn it off and on. Let it come back on. Bit of a delay, not as long as the 710, which is quite a long delay when it comes on. Oh, I didn't even see that. Let's turn it. No. Ah, interesting. So anyway, otherwise, as you can see, it's VHF, UHF, dual band, and 3DS, Icon style, GPS, Bluetooth that I've tested, um, APRS, all the HF bands, and it's just a fantastic looking radio. Look at the menu structure. Look at that. And yes, you can get all your repeaters in there. If you look where the blue menu is, here at the bottom, all your different radio settings. Look, you've got APRS beacon, tone, squelch, repeater, shift, automatic repeater shift, and all the rest. Thanks for watching and yeah, looking forward to everyone getting this in a few weeks time in the in the UK and I know that in the USA you're all enjoying it already. Bye for now.